So Zara Autumn Haul had to be done, the only place where you do an Autumn Haul. The only issue for me is that I'm like a 16, 18, so it's not as easy for me to buy stuff there and look like the models on the website or like your average person walking down the street who is a size 8 and is wearing Zara and looks really good. So I have to work a little bit harder to find the pieces that do work on a curvier figure. And I went shopping this morning and I picked up these six here. They are all in store at the moment, so I will put links below. And I'm going to take you through every single piece, also with a try on video. So let's just jump in. Okay, so first one is this dress. It's $49.99 and I got it in a size large. I will insert a clip here. It looks a little bit like, you know, when you buy ASOS and the packaging it comes in. Um, it's a kind of smock dress, it's pretty full length, it goes down to about my ankles and it's really hard to show in the video so hopefully you'll get a better idea of how you can either dress it up or dress it down in the cutaway. It's really flowy, you just throw it on. I'm going to Barbados in a few weeks, for two weeks, um, and I can imagine just throwing this on over a bikini and um, it just being really comfortable to wear. The sleeves sort of flute out here which is really really nice. And um, it's also tiered, which I think adds some very nice detail. Impossible to show in the video though. I think it's a really great buy. I also really like black and white on blondes. It has this little tie detail here. And yeah, I could just envisage throwing it on with a black bag and some black sliders or dressing up in winter in the UK or autumn, obviously, and wearing it with tights. And the large fit me really well. So I really, really really like this also if you're getting some winter sun this is a good thing to have in your wardrobe for like autumn uk time and then also to use when you go on holiday had to take that off i am way too hot Whew. um the next one is one of my favorites from the little shop i did this morning it's this leopard print olive silk shirt and by leopard print it is literally leopards are the print I really like it because it's different. I loved the leopard print um, kind of thing that everybody had last season, um, but this is just a new take on it. So I put it with white jeans and leopard print boots, which I thought was really fun, like not very obvious and not something I'd usually go for, but I actually thought it was really nice. I think the olive with the white jean is so nice, especially um, if you're quite tanned or if you could fake tan for it. I think that's a really good look with gold accessories. So like I did these hoops with it. Or if you want something a bit more simple, I put it with some loafers that looked like, the, you know, the Gucci ones. This is it, it's comfortable. This is a size XL and this was actually quite roomy on me. So I think an 18 or a 20 could wear this quite comfortably. Um, also my bust, by the way, is a kind of E cup, F cup. So that might give you an idea of how shirts can fix. There's obviously like no stretch in a silk like this. Um, and yeah, I don't have um, a silk in this kind of olivey colour. I've got a cream, I've got grey, and this green is really different, but really, really classy. So I really like that. I also think it's a great shirt that you could wear to like brunch with the girls or to, you know, meet your boyfriend's parents for the first time, which by the way, I'm meeting his family, like extended family properly for the first time next weekend. So I could definitely wear this with my white jeans. I think that would be a really nice look. Um, but yeah, this is a bit different, but you could wear it to so many things, like you could wear it to work, depending on your job, and um, yeah, so many different things you could wear it to. You could also tie it up if you wanted to, um, but tucked in, I think, suited me best and really highlighted my hourglass figure if you wear it with a pair of jeans. Love this, love the print, love the colour. I think this is a really unique colour. Keeping with the theme of shirts, my next pick was this black and white shirt oh goodness <laughs> clashing be prepared for people to ask how it is being an employee at Foot Locker I get this all the time in my shirt um, I'm so glad that they're stocking this again because this is actually old season but they're doing the exact same one in stores now um, it's great though this with like a red lip and a slicked bun and some black jeans is really cool I also styled it again with the white jeans the exact same look that I used for the olive shirt but with um, this shirt here and I just love a stripe like I know curves are supposed to wear um, vertical stripes as well but like whatever to those kind of rules but it does look good this red lip 
gold hoops really really nice really cool with a slick bun yeah very parisian and the thing about shirts like this is that you can put them on and like with a pair of jeans and it looks like you actually really tried hard this with like tight black jeans and high black leather boot heels very cool like that on to my next one and i just found this to link below it couldn't look more different on me than it does on the model on the website so it just goes to show that your different shapes suit and look different in different outfits and it doesn't really matter if you like the top you've just got to get it and i really really love the print on this i've got a couple of shirts with this print actually it must be quite in at the moment so it's a red rose print with a black kind of silk top it's quite low cut it looked quite busty on me but i really like that with this very delicate lace trim here um the bust ever so slightly tight on me so yeah i'm like a double d e sometimes an f i think if you're bigger than an e or an f definitely don't go for this top um it's got these tiny little baby um shoulder pads like they are apps they are this big they're absolutely tiny i've never seen anything like it and they just puff out the shoulder here which is really really nice you'll be able to see it better in the cutaway um and i really like that the cuffs are quite tight here again so that adds this kind of billowing shape to the sleeve a little bit um and then yeah it's quite short so you can just tuck it into any trousers i think white jeans would look really nice black jeans would look really nice with this as well really nice pattern and then i could again see this wearing it with a red lip that matches the exact color just because i like taking bits of my outfit and then incorporating them into my makeup with some gold hoops like these i think perfect again brunch or like date night um i teamed it with some tailored black trousers to give it a bit more of a kind of evening look with some black stilettos which i think looks really cool as well it's a very very pretty top i think i'll see loads of people this season wearing this i think it's new in on the site as well don't quote me on that um but if you're looking for like yeah a bit of like a kind of girly date night top this is really really cute it's 25.99 and i got it in an xl i'd say the xl it feels like a 1416 it's not very generous at all and there is no stretch in the fabric so something to bear in mind if you are doing online deliveries um next top i think is something just quite cute and it's very different for me i'm not super girly but i thought a white shirt and it's this kind of like linen material that they do which is really soft very flowy it's really good for like a hotter autumn day i think and i think it looks so nice with like blue denim and brown boot heels i wore some mini tonkas with it because i thought that looked really cute um and i just liked all the detail around the neck this was 25.99 and i think it looks quite designer actually it's got this nice little elasticated bit here which kind of sits just below my waist and then this flows into onto my hips it's just really light easy to wear i think white and black are just absolute staples in my wardrobe i always have those kind of colors and yeah easy to wear easy to pair stuff with and really not that expensive it was ever so slightly see-through as well so you might want to think about bra solutions which is something again that us curvier girls have to always think of like no bra is never really an option for us and then my final one, which is the most basic, but my most favourite by a mile, is this black top. So it is a top, it is a shirt. In fact, let me just do it up for you. Okay, so that's done up. It's $25.99. It is a large to extra large, and it has this um, kind of just a very slight detail on the neck here with a big pocket. It's supposed to be a shirt, but I saw it and I thought that would look so nice as a dress to throw on for like Sunday roasts or just if you're going out in the evening and you want to be comfortable but you do want to look put together and cool throw this on black tights black boots black bag done um and then you can wear it with like a colorful lip red lip why am i it must actually be autumn if i'm gravitating towards a red lip so much but that is also one of the really lovely things about autumn is that you can experiment a bit more with your makeup i feel um but that hair up hair down i think both will suit um you can even wear it with statement boots like the leopard prints boots that I wore earlier something like that and yeah just throwing it on really cool really easy it was very flowy um it's got some like really light pleating at the back here and yeah 25.99 for like a black dress is pretty good 
my favourite one. So those are a few of the pieces that I picked up today. Let me know which your favourite one is and if you have found anything at Zara that you love that you think particularly suits a curvier figure. I know it is hard to find them but I do think it's worth it because Zara prices are pretty good and they are always quite stylish and when you can get the fit right you really can. I tend to avoid things like um, trousers, bottoms quite a lot and like stuff that I know has no stretch in it. Just things that are like flowy and that I can wear with a lot of different outfits. That's what I look for in Zara the most. So I hope you enjoyed this little one. This is my first little haul. I think it's so cute. Um, if you don't follow me on Instagram already, make sure you do that. I will put a link below. And I hope you enjoyed this little video and liked some of my pics from Zara. So I will see you for the next one. Bye.